Here we go. <laughs> okay, just being really transparent, this is always a problem. Where are they at? Where's Ronnie and Nessie? Isn't that cool? Crazy. It's almost like I knew what I'm doing. Today I'm taking you behind the scenes of Merrill Twins Live. What we do for our live stream every Thursday for Merrill Twins. Back here is my setup. I'm gonna go through what I do to prepare for a live stream every single week. Now, it is Thursday, it's one o'clock. We're live streaming in two hours, so I gotta get on it. All right, so this is the live streaming setup. Um, there's a lot to it. I'll go through everything here in a little bit, but right now I gotta prepare some graphics and a teleprompter this time for the live stream. We're doing something really fun and really cool. And I also have to create a scoreboard, so let's do that. Actually, I just realized something. I wanna create the live stream first on YouTube, so in order to do that, I need to take, I need to get the girls and take a thumbnail and need to turn the lights on. There they are, the lights are all on. Wee, wee, wee. There's the camera right there. So now I gotta go in here, turn on, turn off the lights. Ready and off. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It looks so good right here. Look at that. All right, so next, I gotta go get the girls and we gotta make a thumbnail, so let's do that. Hey girls. Where are they at? Where's Ronnie and Nessa? Okay, change that. The girls are doing something right now. They don't have time to make a thumbnail, but I have to start the stream. I have to create, I have to create this really cool looking a scoreboard. So I'm going to do that really quick and then I'll show you here in a second. Booyah, look at that scoreboard. Oh my goodness. I'm amazing. All right, so the girls are finally here. We're going to do our thumbnail now. We're going to do the thumbnail. Yeah. This is crucial. What time is it? 30 minutes. We have 30 minutes. We still haven't done the thumbnail, so we're going to yeah, do it really do fast. It. Here we go. Do okay, let's do it really quick. Really laugh, Nessa. Ha 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 ha. What is wrong with you? <laughs> All right, good job, ladies. Okay, just being really transparent, this is always a problem. It's always down to the very last minute when it comes to making a thumbnail, because some people... Hey, I hear you. I hear you. Some people... Hey, I've been ready to take a thumbnail. It was Nessa this time. <laughs> I, you guys always blame each other, and it's, it's, it's both of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, it's coming down to it. I just, it's like 15 minutes. I still have to set up the teleprompter, which is pretty much ready. I just don't, I can't find my laptop. I don't know what I do with my laptop. I gotta go find it. All right, I got my teleprompter. I mean, I got my computer for the teleprompter, so I gotta set it up. Man, it's hard to like vlog and, and do all this. Look, all the lights are set up, cameras are set up, prompter's on. Okay, so, all right, let me, let me just put my, so let's hang on. Okay, guys, got everything set up. Um, Ronnie, can you put your microphones on? Mm hmm. Thank you. Okay. Which one is mine? Does it doesn't matter. matter. Okay. As long as it's green. Is it on? Yeah, it's on. Okay, great. Okay, good job. Here, I'm going to take Nessa's out. And then I need this. Right okay. Here. Microphone. Boom. Boom. Okay. Right, thank, thank you. Thank you. It's in mono mode, which is good. Okay, so we're, we're getting there. There I am, there's my camera right there. So hi everybody, I'm vlogging myself. This is what it looks like right now. I've got this really cool graphic that is rendering for the stream uh, before everything starts. So hopefully it'll be done by then. I gotta plug in my audio, so there we go. Are our mics muted? Yes, everything's okay. muted at this point. Okay. So I'm gonna, here we're getting ready to go. I'm gonna make you guys go live. Not live live, but when you see yourselves, you'll be live. So there it is. So we are now officially live. We're just waiting. These are the analytics. Here's Ronnie and Nessa. Hi. Here's the gra here's ground central control. There's that. And as soon as, as soon as we're ready, we'll we'll go. You let me know, girls. Are you ready, Nessa? Hey guys! Hello! We are live! Welcome, Welcome to Merrill Twins Live. I'm Veronica. I'm Vanessa, and today is Thursday, January 12th. And um, we are going to be doing a Try Not to Laugh Challenge today. We just ended the live stream. How'd it go, got girls? It yeah. went great. It was a great live stream. Uh, I ended up changing halfway through. 
She put a suit on to match the vibe of the live stream. It it was good. It was yes. a good one. It was a good one for sure, and it was very fun. You did good. Thank you. So why? Hey, listen. Can you just tell everybody why you guys like <laughs> live streaming? Um, I like live streaming because John just commented. John commented, and right then we the end. ended. Um. I like live streaming because it's a way to connect with your audience in a way that's not similar to YouTube comments. Like you're actually like talking to them live. And I feel like it's a way to grow with your audience and just like learn from them and they learn from you and you just get to like know them. It's just way like better. a more personal like connection mm -hmm. and it's like just a lot more fun to connect that way rather than just kind of like posting videos and then right. just reading comments. I, I think um, I think some of the success, not some of the success, I think a lot of our success is due to live streaming because we've been live streaming since we've started YouTube mm -hmm. and we've always felt this really close connection with our audience because of it. And I think that's just so important to me and Nessa. Yeah, because like, because then like, who are we making videos for? If you don't know, if you don't get, if you don't take the time to try and get to know your audience mm -hmm. or who's watching. That's true. What would you say to, what would you say uh, has been the secret to your success on YouTube? Uh, oh. Your, your dad. Oh, oh our, our dad. dad. Our dad has been the secret, secret to our um, success. Success. Wow, very <laughs> sincere. <laughs> no, honestly though, I think without you, it wouldn't be what it is it would today. Not because you know he does have the knowledge that we don't, and he edits and stuff, <laughs> and he films. And I think if you are wanting to start a channel and stuff, I think it really is important to create a team of mm -hmm. people around you who know what they're doing and who are who do believe in you. And I think that is kind of hard to find. So. Thank you, Father. You're welcome. Thank you. It's really fun. It's actually just a blast to do this with you guys. So, anyway, I'm going to give everybody a tour of uh, our setup. Okay, yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Do it. Here we go. Say here we go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, um, you can see me right there. Hey, guys. How's it going? So, I'm going to show you guys everything that this is that you're seeing right here in front of, in front of us. This is a um, ATIM mini... Extreme ISO. It's made by Blackmagic. This is a switcher. So basically you can go through and you can just all the all the cameras come in from back here through HDMI into this switcher called Blackmagic Design. Blackmagic Design makes some great products for live streaming. They're amazing. They've been in the industry for years and years and years. So you can see it's really, really cool because it, it this will record everything for you. You can stream from it. You can do all of that so um it's really cool you can add graphics through um the downstream key this is really cool now i'm obviously not veronica vanessa but you can see right here that graphic that i just added that was all done live right here and so then i can clear it go from there so the atim mini extreme iso iso uh, means that it'll record all these individual cameras right here so it'll record them all separately onto a hard drive which i have a hard drive right down here it's right there so I have the hard drive down there. This is really an incredible system. This used to cost thousands and thousands of dollars when I first started in the industry. So um, now it's it's really, really affordable. I think, don't quote me, but I think that the ATM mini switcher is about 800 bucks or so. Um, and it does incredible things. So um, yeah, all of our sources are running into this, all of our cameras. I've run up to six cameras on this before. And speaking of cameras, my cameras, all the cameras are right here. So they're really close to me. So if I need to adjust anything, I can just reach out here like this and adjust the camera. It's really, really uh, incredible. And of course, there's, there's where Veronica and Vanessa sit right there. And so I can see them, I can adjust all the cameras. We also have a camera that's designed uh, to be kind of a boom camera over top there. I don't have it on, but uh, yeah, that's kind of it. So um, then we have a mixer right here. It's just a, a small Mackie mixer. Um, my mic goes into it, music comes into it. Then I have uh, a, an audio monitor over there on the other side that I can control the level of the music playing back and any sound effects that we want to do coming out of that. So it's really, really a, a really integrated system and it's small, compact, 
and does the job incredibly. I mean, I'm, I'm very, very, very happy with it. We used to do computer-based. Um, I had I used to have all these cards and stuff in the computer, and it just was not stable at all. But with this right here, this ATM switcher, it is just incredible. What, Ronnie? I'm going to head out. Okay, Ronnie's going to say bye. She's going to head out. Thank you for your help today. You're welcome. Love I'll you, see you tomorrow. Okay. Um, okay. Are you recording from that I am. camera? Yeah, I'm recording. I'm Very recording nice. it through the whole live streaming thing. So see, I was showing them all the stuff that I do. Very cool. With with it, so I'm recording this at the same time while I'm recording on there. Wow. So I'm sync everything up. Isn't that cool? Crazy. It's almost like I know what I'm doing. Almost. Almost know what I'm doing. All right. Okay. So, love you too. Be safe driving home. Uh, a lot of people at are gonna want to know because uh, the the switcher itself, you can you can um, use this for graphics and things like that, um, built in. There there are tons of effects that I have not really gotten into yet, um, but I'm moving that direction with it because we're doing more complicated live streams and I want to do a lot more of that because that's gonna be really really fun to do it. But the switcher itself will do a lot. It's very capable of doing major major like. Uh, you know, events and broadcast news. You can do green screen with it. You can, you can uh, put graphics in, all that built into all of this. Um, the only downside of it, and it's not a downside, okay? Please hear me. I love this switcher. The only downside is the graphics are very limited. Um, you can't do a lot with them. So what I've done is I've taken my iMac Pro and I have the a Blackmagic uh, 8K card. It has, I know it's 4K. No, it's the, it's the 4K card. It has four four ins and outs uh, that is hooked directly to this computer. It has four ins and outs. And so what I can do is this program right here called New Blue Titler uh, 5 um, outputs the fill source and then an alpha channel. And so what the alpha channel and the fill look like is this. So there's a color output. And watch this. So I'm going to do Veronica Vanessa's graphic. That graphic I showed you right here. It comes up right here in the bottom. So this is what it looks like coming into the switcher. You ready? So see right here, the graphics and alpha channel, they come up and see how this one's white and this one's black. So basically it takes the two sources right there, takes both sources, combines them together through the downstream key, which is on the, on right here on the ATM switcher and then it comes out. So basically it creates a transparent background by using two sources. So this program right here outputs two sources. It outputs the alpha channel and the fill. So it gives you all the color is the fill and all that stuff. And then the background, or I'm sorry, the alpha channel comes out and that's what keys it out. That's why you can see me underneath the graphic where if there was no alpha channel, it would just be, you know, black. It wouldn't be anything. So this program is very, very powerful. You can change, you can change things on the fly. Um, like, uh, you know, I made graphics like this become, become a member. It just flies in, flies out. And then I click the button, boom, goes away. It's very powerful. And I actually, I actually just started using this last week and I've gotten into it and it is an amazing, amazing program. I'm really excited, um, about new, new blue and their technology with live streaming and integrating it with the ATEM switchers, and uh, it's just incredible. So something that I would love to do, and these cameras right here, I bought these cameras uh, specifically for uh, doing uh, all of our series that we did, because they're, they're capable of, well, both of them are, are, are qualified for, are qualified to do Netflix production, which is really, really cool. Um, so this is the EVA-1 Panasonic, and this is the uh, S1H Lumix, which is a Panasonic. And right now I'm shooting on a Sony, 7C, but what I want to do is I want to switch over to, and this is the, that is the Sony right there. Um, I can't really see it. There's the Sony A7C right there. Great camera, the autofocus is amazing. Look at that. You can just get right in there. So I love the cameras, they're great. They're great for all of our post-production, our, all of our like series and sketches and things like that, but they don't work as well for live. So I've been really, now, let me just, they work fine for live. That's not it. But in, in the ecosystem of black magic, they, it doesn't integrate as well. So if I were to upgrade, I would get some black magic cameras, which are really, really affordable in comparison. This camera right here, this camera right here, brand new, was like seven, eight thousand dollars. All right. Their cameras are like two thousand. 
And what's cool about them is because they're integrated and they integrate with this system. You can color correct, you can control all the cameras from within the software. Oh, which by the way, the Blackmagic uh, ATM software looks like this on the computer. You can actually control the switcher from here. So if I'm like, oh, I wanna go to Veronica and, and Vanessa, boom, there they are, and I'm back. So you're just hitting that button right there. I can switch it. I can actually do a lot on the computer. The computer does a lot. So it integrates with this and this, and then on the computer, you have the, the media pool, which is where you can do graphics and things like that. See, I have a Veronica and Vanessa right there and some backgrounds and things like that. And that's built into this system right here. That's all built in. So this is very powerful. So then you also, not only, not only do you have all of that, you have all your audio channels from every input that you have right here in a mixer. And you can add uh, dynamics, you can add EQ, you can add compression, limiting, all of that to your audio. And it, it just makes it so much easier. It's all built into this thing. It's, it's really, really incredible. That's this. And then, then if you get the Blackmagic cameras, then you can control the cameras completely. These are each of the, each of the channels that are available. Actually, there's eight channels, there should be, yeah, there's eight. So you could run eight cameras and you can control all their gain, the way they look, their shutter, everything. You can even record. Oh, and that's what's even better is I'm recording everything right now from this Blackmagic on into, from this camera onto the hard drive onto this and it's syncing these cameras up together. It's pretty cool. That is the setup. It's, it's really, really functional. It works really good, and um, I love live streaming. It's really challenging, really fun. I'm gonna do some more live streaming on my channel, so look for that soon. But um, let me know what you guys think. I mean, I know there's a lot of people, there's a lot of reviews on these, these switchers. You can go out and, and check them out. They are just absolutely incredible. I highly recommend. If you're going to do live streaming, they have different models. They have another one of these that's a four channel, and I wanna say it's under $400. And that's really, and it, it does all the same things as that this does. Just only has four um, camera inputs. This has eight. And I wanted to do eight because I wanted to use two of those channels for my alpha channel, which is incredible. And then I, I got to show you how cool this program is. Um, I did this, I, I did this scoreboard for the girls. Look at this, this new blue titler. I did it just, it's like live sports graphics just right here. Um, I did the bonk dog, boom. Bonk dog, bonk dog. Um, and then like, you can also make your own movies and then like, this is, this is a graphic I built from the last show and just put it right in. So it works really well. I really, th I, I mean, now that, this is a little pricey, but it's worth it. If you're gonna do, if you're gonna elevate your, um, your live stream, I mean, look how cool those graphics are. They just come right in and out and you can animate everything. I love, I love the way that looks. It's just incredible. And I'm just barely scratching the surface of this thing. New Blue Titler Live 5 is amazing. So I, I highly recommend it. So there it is. That is our setup for Merrill Twins Live. I hope you enjoyed that little behind the scenes peek of what we do every week. I will see you next Thursday uh, on Merrill Twins Live and also next Saturday. I'm gonna be posting every Saturday from here on out. So subscribe. Do all the things that everybody does. You guys, we love you. Have a great week, and we'll talk to you later.